welcome back. In the last episode we left Elliot Falls, Twin Falls. Um, we continue on this. Pulling up to a campsite now, um, and tomorrow we're doing the North End, which will have Nolan's Crossing. We've got another four or five crossings to do as well. Then we'll be at the tip of Australia. We have a secret camp. Shut up! Um, so it should be a nice little beach camp, a couple of days there, and then we are punching out to the icy cold Alice Springs for the Fink Desert Race. Honestly, we were there one year and we woke up and all the, all the water tanks were frozen ice. Just, oh, here's, here's a good spot here. Come and show me the waterfall by our campsite. Oh yeah, check this out. Gonna get the rooftop tent up, gonna have waterfront views. Yeah, you just pick the closest. Yeah. Is this one of the ones we've walked up before? What? Whoa, sh we stacked it with a camera. Let's spilt my beer. What do you think? Um, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. It is nice. I'll give it a... 8 out of 10. Get in the drink. Yep. Like so Nav, no one knows you on my channel, but you're a oh, bit of a bush expert, a bit of a survival expert. What did you just say? So, you, we got these stuff? pandanas through here, all through the top end of Australia, you got these pandanas. You can actually eat the middle of them. Tastes like shit, like most bush tucker does, but it can save your life if you start. It's got nutrients. It's got nutrients, it sure does. Come have a look. Bring right. some back here. I'll, I'll explain it to you. You gotta go to the middle of the pandanas. Middle. Ah! It looks like spring onion. Oh, I'm not gonna eat it, you can eat it. Yeah, I'm not gonna bite, eat it. Bite either. the last. A few centimeters that off. Yeah. But what is it? You, you chew it or just? Just chew it. Okay. It's just like yucky spinach. Perfect. If you're starving for whatever reason, you get stuck. So we've got Darcy's if, if your car breaks you down, down yeah. and you need to eat some of this. Pandanus. Well, everywhere through the top end. What looks similar to pandanus but you can't eat nothing? Is it pretty obvious? Pretty yeah, obvious. It's pretty obvious, yeah. This is the one that grows like this, the low ones. Mm. There's ones that grow on the beaches, the saltwater ones. Yeah. Yeah, no good. No good. Oh, no good. <laughs> Let's go for a walk! We're eating Again? Papa. <laughs> <laughs> I got all fours on there! I got all fours on there! Oh, oh, sh so that little bit that I just fell in was so much more empty, you could lay in it and the water just came over your shoulders and we like got some soap and had a scrub up. Now it's like flowing heaps, this is the crossing, it's like clay and muddy, it's pretty sick. I think this is Sam Creek. It's my favourite, it's my name. <laughs> We're doing video inception. There's the turtle. Typical tele track fashion, there was water crossing after water crossing. We punched on to make some ground to get to the next campsite before the day was over. Alright, so day three on the telly track, we've just come to Cypress, Cypress Bridge. Bridge. Cypress Bridge. Cypress so, Bridge. um, yeah, we kind of got here and Ooh. this is happening right now. So, this is Cypress Creek and it's a log bridge. And every year after you rebuild it, because obviously the wet punches it out. I saw a post on the Cape York Adventures page of the guys that built it, but more and more cars have kind of just sunk a bit. It's about a half an hour, but. Sort of made it just good. Yeah, they need it longer. Yeah. This is making me a bit nervous. Yeah. Can he can he left hand down and just drive straight? Yeah, it's in real slow. Slow. Woo! Who's next? <laughs> Who's next? Thanks for scaring the shit out of us. Next is um, Maddie's up. 
see how he goes. He's like six ton combined, so we'll soon see. Hopefully he's all right. It's just where the log kicks right there is a bit scary part. This is Logan. It is. We just finished Cyprus. Pretty hectic across the bridge there. A bit of a slow run there. That was quite rocky, but we've appeared at Logan's. This one actually isn't on the map. Well, it's not on my map at least, but it's on yours? Yeah, it's not. This is this is the one where you don't... People always go around the other way because it's real short. Oh, yeah, but it's mud. It's, and they just get stuck and they sink their cars. Yeah. Foot to the floor, Matty. <laughs> Yo! I'm actually gonna walk this before I drive it. Nah, mate, just follow the car in front. That was good. It was what I expected, but we got water in our car, so I've got a gaping hole in there. Whoops. That's my fault. <laughs> It's all part of the fun, getting a bit of water in your car, I reckon. No mud in my car yet, though, so that's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> no ones, here we go. See how deep she is? Apparently far left is the line to take. Yeah, it's got a rock bottom. I'm right, just get something to pull straight through. So we're currently no one's already. Oh, it's deep as in this yeah. one, but we're gonna take this line because he was um, quite full of water. Uh, Matty, I reckon I'm gonna have the same fate as that guy. You'll be right. Shit <laughs> it in. I missed it! I'm kidding! <laughs> Backflip? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Here it is. Nolan's the last crossing of the jelly trap. going the same speed or if not slightly faster than what you're going just so that it keeps the momentum. As soon as your tyres spin, you lose all grip. Well there we are, Nolan's is done. We got one more of our crew to come through um, and then we basically hit the tip off to Bamaka, tip of Australia. That is it, the last major crossing. I've actually pulled a knock sensor code. 
I was wondering why I wasn't getting on boost and why I wasn't working. Knock sensor code, so I reckon one of those are a bit wet and um, Tadhisi fits, so when we stop, I'll um, undo them, clean them, and put them back in. All right, we're here. This is the tip. We have about a half K, maybe a bit more walk. This is a straight in the hair behind me. Apparently, got to get all the photos. This is it. We're going to do sunset, but we got here a bit early. But that's all right. We'll take a beer up, go get the photo, and we're boosting off to Punson Bay tonight for a bit of a more of a camp site setup so we can do a bit of washing, get sorted, and then uh, I don't know, probably spend a couple of days up here. Use that bloody tinny has been dragging around everywhere. This is the first time the boat's seen water since I've seen you. Yeah, we'll be in tomorrow. We're in the <laughs> All right. We'll be in the drink tomorrow, we'll be going fishing. It needs a wash. It does need a wash. You plan on camping up there, bro? I've been saving <laughs> these for the tip. <laughs> oh, yes. Don't have to even drink oh, the Oh, oh what? Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Celebrity. At least one of us wearing a built and I bought shirt up there. Okay guys, so... My audience keeps saying they want to see more Cody's. Really? So. Well, I'm here. Um, we're at the Cape. All the way here, finally made it. <laughs> Gave my hair a quick strain because, you know, we drove all the way black. here for like, the photo, black, so the hair black. has to look that's good, that's right? Sure. Dan's yeah. made me wear my built not bought yeah. shirt, but feeling good. These are cold, <laughs> and I'm a happy girl! <laughs> Again, it's been a good six years in a different car this time. So now we're gonna do it another time, maybe on a dirt bike. Who knows? Let me know. Maybe do I bring Sid up here? Comment down below. Let me know if you bring. If the top comment gets the most likes to say I bring silly Sid, I will. Do... I won't do it. I'll bring it on the trailer, mate. Yeah. Look, the Triton made it, so you can bring pretty much anything up here. Yeah. It's a challenger, though. It is a challenger, correct? It was a challenge for you, for everyone, for Aka, all the crew. Epic, epic adventure. Um, now we're boosting back. Well, a couple are going home and then we're continuing on to Fink. So we're going from the tip out to the desert. So stay tuned for that. And um, yeah, we'll be doing some desert action. Some cold nights coming up and a whole heap of racing and horsepower. That's what I'm game for. Oi, Sammy, what are you doing? I want to prank Matt. So I want to either take his steering wheel off or the gear stick out. Fuck. Sam, you're cooked. We are doing a steering wheel delete. It's gonna be so funny. You're gonna hop in his car and be like, Where's my steering wheel? <laughs> how, do you get, how do you get this airbag? <laughs> Today we see the airbag blow up. Quick, 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 quick. Wait, quick, Michael. Give me a socket. There we go, it comes up. And we're off, we're off. There we go. Steering wheel delete. <laughs> Wait, I lost the nut. What happened last night? I don't know. You stole someone's steering wheel. Yeah. I was there like, I was here last night and there was um, like this little knock. Knock. I'm like, <laughs> fucking someone's going into my canopy. And then I went like this and went, zip. And I saw two little people run away. <laughs> Banks, what did you do? What'd you do? Because <clears throat> I heard two people fucking run off and then your lights turned on. Take my engine out. You fucking did something big. What took you so long? They have the tools out. What are you doing? Get out, bad. <laughs> What'd you do? Sweet, it's mint. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <fuck> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hovercraft. <laughs> hey, they did the hovercraft conversion. The wheel delete. <laughs> yeah. Did you like your steering wheel delete? Well, can we get your reaction down? <laughs> oh no, me wheels missing. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Steering wheel's gone. What do you mean it's gone now? <laughs> Where'd it go? It's just gone. <laughs> oh my God, okay. We put it so deep in the box. So deep. And then we covered it in leaves. <laughs> <laughs> the trade. Oi, come on. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. 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 I got a foot on it. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> 
You got wheelie, half of it. Your wheelie made a mess of this. Well, I want my wheel nuts. So you can have your airbag. The road's a river. Oh, oh we're here at the very wet prop tent. I should get like one of these ones. Okay. Oh. Pink crocodile. <laughs> there you go. No, I don't think I'll get anything. I've literally still got my shirt from here from like six years ago. So I'm going to keep that. I don't want the hat. Does the hat look cute? Yay! Your new shirt. Proper raining. My thunder and everything. Road has turned to slop. So we're starting to pass some of the variety bash cars, check them out. 100 cars coming across. We're about to go to the and there might be a bit of a line up there, we can see some more, but we were just in front of them the whole trip from Bramwell. We'll look at them, there's more. That is what we missed. <laughs> so lucky, there's so many cars about to head up there, like 100. The outboard fell off. Are you serious? Yeah. Actually? Nah, just joking. Yeah, I'm scared. <laughs> Sorry, I had to. Camera keeps pouring off when nothing else is Oh, so my front front draft shaft bolts came loose. Don't know whether it was the boys pulling, trying to stitch me up the other night, but they said they only tried the back one, but the front one's loose, so it's like, oh yeah. Do you get it or? Oh, bloody. oh, Sam's trying to blame me because his car's broken because <laughs> we took a wheel off his car. But you need two 17s, which I don't have, so he's got. You can't blame me. I said as soon as something breaks on his car, he'll blame me, and straight to it. Cody knows best. I said pull over when it first happened, and he's like, no, 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 no. Listen to the apprentice. Driving into the night, making it into Musgrove. And I just played a game with everyone. Rich people have it. I mean, rich people want it. Poor people have it. And if you eat it, you die. Put in the comments down below what you reckon it is. It's a good one. It took them about 20 minutes. A few moments later. I don't know how much footage we got of this, but um, we just crossed the river and now we're getting out of it. The all winch. Here's the all winch. Do you want to pull yours out? Yeah, I'll, I'll come as an anchor. Don't know how much of this we um, you would have seen, or I didn't feel much. I'll try to get some stuff off the map, but we had to cross this massive river. I think it's the Alice River or something. Anyway, huge. Big crossing, soft sand, pretty deep. And the exit out is fully washed away by the wet season, so we've had to go around it, and it's very slippery, very boggy, very muddy. I had to winch out. I don't think we've got footage of that, but here's Matt behind me. On to me. How did my wheel tracks end up here and he's over there? Easy, you'll drive that. Nice! Look at the mess we made today, all the big day of driving. We did 12 hours, I feel like. 12 hours of driving, but look at this mess. Of all the messes, this you is the up. ultimate mess. I messed up. The bloody yogurt fell over and it went all down the side of the fridge. I oh, know. We need it. Whose fault is this? Yours because it's your yogurt? No. Or me because it's my fridge? I think you because of your shitty driving. I don't know how to clean things, I'm a boy. Okay, do you want me to do it? Yeah. Well. Oh, that looks great. Yeah, but I'm a bit oh, cringe. Dang. Oh. Well, um, welcome back to a uh, fridge rundown. <laughs> spilt not burp. Oh, there's a V8 right here. The spilt not boy. Oh, this is, so this is custom. That's so great. All right, we've made a lot of ground. Last night we stayed in, uh, I always forget the name, something in wheels. Punch it this morning, we're in Mount Isa and we've all decided to get heated blankets here. We're racing to the BCF because we, they're in Alice Springs and we sold out because it's cold. It's like two degrees every night. 
They're all getting heated blankets. So the plan is to put a normal heated blanket underneath 240 of the inverter, and then put this 12 volt top. What is it like? An actual sheet with heats in it. Yeah. I swear he's asked you like four so times. So good. Is it a sheet or a dirt? Shut the f*** up. It's both, so you can get... Put in something? Oh my yeah, god, so, damn, shut up! So you, <laughs> you can get one. It's underneath, and it's one on top. Yeah. Tell them the bad news. Someone yeah. rang, and they have none left. Who rang? <laughs> Someone else rang, we're like, yeah, we rang, yeah. So Ali's currently on the phone to BCF, because um, Sam Isles wants an electric blanket, and so what Matt is doing, He's calling them up and reserving them all. <laughs> Watch this, Sammy, you know why yeah. you ran out of blankets. Meanwhile, back in the lowlands. Yes, yeah, wait. Got it all, we finally found it. Went to a few different shops. Got the blankets, got the Ugg boots. I to get new uh, snorkel filters, so we got that. Got most of the supplies. Now we're gonna find the rest of everyone. We'll bail it on us. I'm just scared of being cold, guys. It won't be cold. <laughs> A few moments later. Oh, oh, we bloody made it to somewhere windy. I tell you what's exciting on a really boring road. A sign. This sign. So now everything just is a little bit more dead. The speed limit's 130, which is good. And it's just gonna be straight flat roads. Just punch another six hours today. Try and get the three ways. Try and get to the turn off before tenant. It's cold this morning. My f***ing friend. <laughs> it's so cold. We're not even in Alice yet. It's only like, it's only just like take the water four away. degrees maybe. You've already it's had cold. your coffee now. I'm washing my cup and you're coming just yeah, take the water away. Right, next stop Alice, we're like four hours out. It is getting a bit chilly. We are at Discovery Resort. We kind of got a bloody, bloody good deal because the Patriot Boys reserved a, a site because it books the whole town out and they didn't end up using it. So we're staying here. And it's epic! It's the best. Look, there's a water slide. There's apparently go karts, and at least obviously we're gonna have a shower and do go the go karts. I'm gonna go go karting. Yes. I didn't know there was go karts. Yeah, somewhere here. <laughs> we're here. I think we're right next to the laundry as well. We've got to do a ton of washing because this is just. Good. It's getting a bit full, you know. And my bloody hoodie got wet last night, you know. It's all just all bad. Hey, mate. Bought some bloody UGG boots. Still got the price you, tag on them. You'd, big you'd think it's bloody cold or something <laughs> here, eh? Right, we're gonna have one each. Yeah, one each. Look at this, <laughs> made for me or memory foam. I have just had the sore stomach and we're eating KFC. It's alright, it's good for your health. Well, I'll take it back if you don't want it. <laughs> you sure? Oh, oh, a bit of wind going on. Oh, hey, 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 hey! Gee, you'll get bloody. Whoa! Free <laughs> KFC happy. and you try and <laughs> take <laughs> me nuggets. Don't touch a man's nuggets. You can't <laughs> take a bloke's nuggets. What kind of do you live on? Someone took a bite out of my burger. Yeah, it was you. No, it was one of them and they haven't told me. Eat around it then. Yeah, when I opened the, the packet oh, up. I saw yeah, that I'd eat around that bit. So the plan today, we are going to... I mean, we've got to come back into town a lot for like scrutineering, street parade, all that. So we're not going to camp right out at the Patriot camp till like Friday night because it's about 60k an hour and a bit. We don't want to be coming up and down. We're just going to camp somewhere really early on the track, maybe 5, 10k in, just so we can duck back into town when we need to and then do the big camp later on. So that's where we're heading now. A bit of a chill day today. Not many people doing much. Cars are still testing, getting their shit ready. And then, um, yeah, I'll probably show you the street parade, see a lot of the cars, and um, a lot of the teams all go to the same spot at the same time. So we'll do that, and then prologue, race day. Damn! <laughs> You're set. What's up? Dude, oh, I watch your, all your videos. I'm me. never washing this hand again. I want to see those things race around that remote Yeah, that track, yeah. Do they Dude. do jumps and shit? We'll be there. We'll be there later. Sick, man. They look fun as. They are. Woo. Three days later. Here it is. This is the same camp I was at last year, and there's no one here. I didn't do much filming last time. There was like 20 camps, 25 people, I don't know, whatever. But there's a little cave up there. And then a massive fire tonight. We're gonna get all the firewoods. Oh, how good does this look when it's dirty? You shouldn't have cleaned yours, eh? Yours looks. I just love a dirty car. Now, quickly, I want to let you know. Obviously, we are camping here for a couple of days, so the biggest thing is battery because we're not driving every day. I've got obviously on the tent. There's a solar panel, 190 watt 
red arc blanket. I've got another red arc blanket. This is a 300 watt. It's a beast of a blanket. And I've run it through the input on the other side. And just to test, I mean, the battery's charged at the moment, but I'm gonna whack this toasty machine on with the inverter, which will pull like 80 amps. And then we can see how much the solar is actually pumping in. So that's on. You see it's like pulling. Shit. I can't see. See, there you go. 80 amps. We're getting 21 amps of charge straight off the solar only, which is about 300 watt. That'll get us out of trouble for this trip. Have both those blankets out all day and we'll have almost 30 amps charge and it should keep the battery at 100%. Man, I can make me toasties for lunch. Can you video me taking my shirt off? Of course I can. No, Finally. The Finally, it's been kilometers of mud. I can finally take this off and use it. This is why I built this thing out here in the desert. Do you need a poo? No, I don't need one, but I will eventually. We will set it up somewhere. And this is a little clean. How are you going to be able to dig the dirt so yeah. hard? Yeah, with a shovel. You're going to sit right there. Oh, wow, that's actually softer than I thought. Right there. It's soft as shit. Get it? <laughs> <laughs> sit in that? No, I'm not going to shit in that. you are. No. I've been really lucky and I have... Are you going to um, shit in it? No. Because I have been able to get a toilet every time. Somehow. Nah, but are we getting toilets this year? Wow. Just luck. To be honest, Michael did say he was going to bring some port but... Yeah, where's your I don't see any. Chucking to a city of a sight. It's all I just know it down around. No new faces, no strangers vanish. I remember we were down, we never panicked. We were super rocking. Make your little tornado has arrived. The Patriot crew has arrived. The whirlwind. How's everything going with the truck? So last I don't year, wanna say last, it. No, I don't, wanna, really I don't wanna say it. Last year they couldn't quite make it back. Flex plate issues, but you've yeah. been very thorough. The truck's been rebuilt, I'm sure. We went down to we the went, chassis, yep. we pulled the Starting thing in. like down to the chassis, we're new motor. Yep. Trans has been back down to Albans, yep. new rear end, even the side by side, side, new motor. Yeah, yeah new motor and the side by side. Yep. This year's yeah, it's got to come together this year. Yeah. It has to. Day one, I just want to cross that line in a decent time, mm. and then if everything's all good, day two, yeah. that'll be the full sound. The boys are saying it's a bit rougher this year, eh? Cause Man, it's, it's, they, it's the track's yeah. kind of back to Fink. Yeah, right. It's yeah. back to where Fink used to be, what yep. I remember it from back in the day, and the holes are big. Yep. Um, coming back, heading north, man, like it's big square edge, deep holes, and like... <laughs> Kilometers you have to be them. going faster, or it just turns. Yeah, it's so where's it's... a good spot for us to sit? Same as last year, mate. I still, or... I still reckon if you're on the gate between yeah. uh, Deepwell and Maryvale, yeah. where you were last yeah, year, I reckon walking. that's still the best spot. Yeah. Unless you want to travel 100 k's down the track, mm. which you don't really want to do yeah, that, no, we'll especially do that. not we'll on just... race day, mate. Oh, yeah, how's the how's the bloody FJ? We're gonna be filming that soon. Yeah, we didn't bring it out here. Nah, it's not here. No, I, but I've seen. We, we didn't see much as we get back, but we need to do a rig. I know you've been thrashing every weekend. Oh, it's been good. Yeah, we'll do a rig rundown if. It's not Absolutely. out already, but if it is, I'll put a link down below. But um, yeah, yeah we definitely got to do a yeah, walk around it. on that. For sure. I want to take it for a drive. <laughs> yeah, you can for sure. <laughs> you haven't broken anything yet, or you uh, nah, just um, cosmetic? Nah, um, I just uh, injected, started yep. taking them on and off like yep. for five or so times. So now they're leaking, so I've got to get yeah, some okay. injector lines. Yeah. Apart from that, it's been on song. It's been sick, beautiful. Sick. Look at this thing. Patriot Games coming right out here, the big beast. <laughs> Have you had a hectic week? Ah, it's been pretty crazy. You guys crazy. get pumped when you come to these, bloody. Yeah. It's pretty um, crazy so far. Yeah, not <laughs> as bad as last year. Last year was like full convoy, this, that. This year's just racing, it's style yeah, back. A little which bit is more awesome. concentrated on that. Yeah. Well, we've got a couple of days and then we'll be full. Yeah, so. Cold? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> it is damn chilly. One year ago, today probably, we're up in this cave. Me and Mia we were singing a song up here, yeah. All right, we're gonna go up and have a look at the cave. We decide to go up there. Actually, the girls are already up there. All right, start bloody walking. Oh, can you see them on that? Oh, hang on, I can, yes, I can zoom, <laughs> I can clearly run and see them. All right, let's go, go on. Try and get everyone to come. Ready, show me. Yes! <laughs> These Ugg boots keep rolling over on themselves. I'm so unfit. I want to be in shorts and thongs right now. Ready for this. Whoa! The king of the world! Oh, there we 
Alright, well, right. well there we go. Well that's the end of uh, today's go watch the sun go down top of the hill Cape Pate Camp Pate we got Sam trying to be a dickhead in the background he's a long way behind we're gonna head down have a few beers with the fire and then probably throw Ali in the fire throw Sam in the fire should be a great little afternoon should be a good arm to wrap it up to wrap it up my name's Sam Miles my name is Sam Miles and Matt is a dickhead <laughs> I'm onto it! Oh god, I don't know. I came up here for one bloody reason. It won't upload. Why won't it upload this photo? I just want to be an influencer and upload this photo. I got reception. That's why I'm here. Not for this. Good morning. So we had to run back into town yesterday because obviously you've been seeing Cody do a ton of study this trip. So he had to upload an assignment. Driving fast. Look who's on the side of the road. Hello? It's a special falcon. You making TikToks in there? Yeah, mate. Is the onesie warm? Sup. Sup. <laughs> we pulled in super late, so I couldn't really show anything, but I'll let James tell the story about this car because it's a bit of a bit of a laugh. This will be good for the race. We can give the Patriot crew an advantage. What? <laughs> I didn't know onesies. You get a sleeping bag. It's got legs. <laughs> So quickly tell us a 10 second rundown of what the fuck is going on, what, oh, how you're here. I was going to go to Fink uh, and was going to spend all the money on fuel anyway. So then I was like, I might as well go get a flight, pick up this car. It's got a major it's dent in it, <laughs> mind you. Bit of a dent. A bit of a so dent. So you flew from Brisbane to Perth to buy a car, sight unseen, and then oh. drive it across Australia. Yes. Through to Great Central Road. And you made it here. You're yes. halfway home. Where do you find that <laughs> shit? Uh, <laughs> Audi. Audi's Audi. got everything! Yeah. Yeah. Got yeah. Chainsaws, <laughs> <laughs> Fucking everything. Squat. This is not that heavy. I literally squat like 80 kilos. Do you? Yeah. <laughs> That's why she's got big cake. <laughs> Holy sh**. Well, good morning. Check out this beautiful bloody landscape. We're on the same section as last year. There's a big whoop section down the back for the prologue. Um, they all normally get a bit of speed up through here. Carnage when the bikes come through. But it looks a bit more graded than last year. So we'll see how it goes, but this is a pretty good spot. It's down the top of the car. Everyone lines up, there's a fence line. It's pretty much as close as you can get to the track on the prologue section, so. Hey! Morning, brass. Very chilly. So it's still like minus 10 degrees. The sun isn't coming out. An ingenious plan, we've got our uh, forced induction fire. <laughs> Look at that. The old blower. <laughs> the cables are around it. Just made a meme. <laughs> we'll wait for Matt's reaction. Getting on the meme train. I'm the real cowboy train, aren't I? <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> what? You're so funny. I'm so funny. funny. I'm funny. What's happening? So right now the bikes are going. Sitting off the back of it, like a bop, 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 bop.
you gotta look at the shape. <laughs> Neighbors, make sure if you're riding with a helmet, we didn't have any. It's it's fun. I'm buying two right now. Okay, that escalated quickly. There was no introduction. <laughs> Some fans next door, a bunch of kids bought a whole lot of 110s and I was like, give me a bike. I've been craving a ride all week. And then we went down this back track. There's no footage of that. Big bikes, like 450s, 250s, doing this big circuit. I was chasing them. Came up to this big jump, this tabletop. It was like, I don't know, a meter high. Just bought straight over the edge. Sick fun. And then we came back and did a little race down. I can say I rode Fink now on a bike. Next year, I'm gonna bring a toy out. I might bring a couple of those little things. Sick fun. The next day. Oh, shit. I just ran out of bed. I just woke up. You can hear the chopper coming. You hear that first, and then you hear that trophy truck. Holy shit! Because I went out to go film some more and I think the cars are done. Bikes and X, they'll be gnarly on this, it'll be hips overtaking. Carnage on the whoops, I reckon. Been a bloody epic day. Today's race day number one. I'm probably not going to film much tomorrow. I don't know. I just want to enjoy it. But look at this sunset, the skyline, fire. They all work just as good. Unreal. Cheers, awesome. Big great, horse. Great day. If only you could see the shit we got up to. I have to try and get some airdroppy off people's phones. <laughs> Wheeling quads and all sorts of bad stuff. Guys, if you like this video, make sure to click up here to subscribe to the channel. Click over here for our latest merchandise on our website. And down below or to the side, I'm not sure where it is, is our last episode. If you haven't watched it, click on that to check it out. See you guys.